In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to refresh your Zero Bank feed in just about five minutes. Keeping your bank feed up to date is crucial for maintaining accurate financial records, and I'll guide you through the process, ensuring it's seamless and straightforward. Whether you're a small business owner or managing the finances of a larger enterprise, this tutorial has got you covered. First things first, let's head over to your Zero dashboard. This is your financial control room, where you can get a quick overview of your business's financial health. You can access the dashboard by simply going to the Xero website and logging into your account. Once logged in, you'll be greeted by the dashboard. If you're not automatically directed there, you can easily navigate to it by selecting the dashboard option from the menu. The dashboard is designed to give you a snapshot of your financials, displaying various accounts, including your bank accounts. Now let's focus on the bank account you'd like to refresh. On the dashboard, locate the Business Bank Account section. You should see your linked bank accounts listed here. Each bank account displayed has a context menu that can be accessed by clicking on the three dots, often referred to as the More Options button, situated on the right-hand side of the bank account you want to refresh. This button is your gateway to several account-specific actions, so go ahead and click it to reveal the options available for your bank account. Among the drop-down options, look for the one that says Refresh Feed. Clicking this option prompts Xero to manually update the bank feed, pulling in the latest transactions from your bank into Xero. This is particularly useful when you need the most current information for reconciliation or financial decision making. However, it's important to be aware that not all banks support this manual refresh option because some accounts are designed to update automatically. Furthermore, the availability of the Refresh Feed feature can vary significantly from bank to bank. This distinction is often based on the agreement between Xero and your financial institution regarding how data is exchanged. Keep in mind, if you don't see the Refresh Feed option, it could be due to your bank's automatic update system. In this scenario, your bank transactions should naturally flow into Xero, based on a regular schedule, typically once a day. For instance, certain banks have arrangements that automatically update bank feeds in the early hours of the morning. So if you've logged in and noticed some transactions aren't showing up yet, they might appear after the next automatic update cycle. It's also worth noting that the frequency and timing of automatic updates can differ among financial institutions. And this timing can influence when your data appears in zero. If consistency or update frequency becomes a concern, it might be worth reaching out to your bank to understand their specific integration features with Xero. As you work on keeping your bank feed up to date, here's a quick tip. Regularly refreshing your feed when possible or checking in after automatic updates have occurred can help ensure that your financial data in Xero remains current. This habit can be invaluable, especially during busy seasons or at financial year ends when accurate, timely data is crucial for reporting and decision making. In summary, refreshing your Xero bank feed when available is a simple process. Start on your dashboard, locate your business bank account, click on the three dots to access more options and select refresh feed if it's available. Remember, the availability of this feature depends on your bank's integration with Xero and some accounts are updated automatically. Thanks for watching this tutorial. We hope it has clarified how to refresh your bank feed in Xero and highlighted some of the considerations surrounding automatic and manual updates. Keeping your bank feed current ensures that your financial records are accurate, allowing for better financial management and decision making. Stay tuned for more helpful guides and tips to manage your finances efficiently and effectively.